What is going on everybody? Welcome back to RC Car Garage. In today's video, I got some RC news for you. So this past week, we've had a couple things, a couple companies that have come out with a couple things. And uh, for starters, we're gonna go with uh, T-Pro. So good, let's go here on their Facebook page. And uh, T-Pro has come out with uh, some new tires for touring cars. Um, they are glued on tires with foams that are um, long, that have a long wear compound. Uh, they are for one tenth touring cars. You can probably use it for any type of street cars that you're gonna be using. Um, but they came out with a long wear compound, which is nice because tires don't tend to last long. Um, but as you guys can see here in these pictures that these things actually look pretty decent. Uh, and if you, if I zoom in here, you guys can see that there is a, let me move myself out of the way here. There's a T pro logo on the tire itself. And, uh, you got your 12 millimeter hex here in the back. These are glued on wheels, guys. I mean, glued on tires, guys. Um, these wheels actually don't look that bad. You can probably paint them or something to whatever color you guys want them to. They are only going to be coming out in white. And these tires, I believe you can get them for a grand total of, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so I don't know how much they are going to cost, but T-Pro has uh, come out with some new touring car tires. Um, next news that we got, let me exit, go back to here, exit that. Uh, the next news that we have is Trio. So Trio has come out with some brakes, you guys which these things look absolutely awesome. I do like the way they look. Uh, you can get them for a grand total of $29.98. And go to this picture here. You see right there the screws that come with it, uh, the grub screws and everything. These are the brake calipers. You have the brake rotors there. They are 12 millimeter. They are for the axial rift. Um, but you can probably use them for any other RC just to get that scale look. Uh, they have made them, I believe they made them specifically for the Axial Rift. So here we go, they are the Trill Aluminum, let me highlight this right here, Trill Aluminum 7075 Hex Rotor Caliper uh, 2 for the Axial RBX10 Rift. Uh, in the package, it includes the two brace cubs, the calipers, and the hardware. So for all you guys that want to get into the scale part of the RC and make your axial rift look at a little more scale, here you go with these uh, calipers and rotors for you. Enduro has come out with a version two of the trail Enduro Trail Builders Kit. Uh, as you guys can see here, you can get it for $249.99 and they have that as out of stock because they don't even have it available yet. Uh, this kit is just so new. <laughs> they don't even have it available yet. Uh, there are a couple things that I was looking at here on their site. Here's what the kit looks like. <clears throat> they have some, um, here we go, make this thing bigger for you guys to see. So they have the chassis mounted servo up here. You can see that, as you can see on these shock towers that you can mount, they have plenty of positions for the shocks. Um, you have your battery pack is going right here on the front end of it. Keep that front end weight. So when you go uh, scaling, trailing, it's not gonna be flipping. Uh, and everything. Um, they have upgraded this builder's kit with the uh, with their GKS shock towers in the front and the rear, and um, GKS aluminum track bar. Uh, they 
have done a couple great things with this. Uh, you can go onto their website, as you guys can see here, and it has all the information that you need to find out what exactly is going on with this thing. Um, it also brings a steel 25T servo horn, metal ball bearings included, machine steel top shaft, metal ring gear, machine input pinion gear, and so on and so forth. These are the features that are on this rig. The wheelbase I'm looking at right here is a 12.3 inch wheelbase, high clearance links uh, with an updated look with our five millimeter heavy duty links. Um, and of course it has the FT logo on it, which this thing looks absolutely awesome. There you go. Let's maximize this here. Here is the links with the stamped uh, logo on there. We have the shocks here. Um, so what I can see here is that you can actually change. You have the different positions for the shocks, as I was saying. So you don't have to do too much with the uh, with the body. So here you have your pan bar, servo bar. Um, so here is the motor. Let's expand that here. So you have no overdrive. Overdrive is uh, sold separately. Stock set, stock 5.7% overdrive included in the kit. And your second option, 11.83 overdrive included in the kit. So uh, yeah, they, they have, um, they've given us a, a couple more options for this uh, Trying to get to that picture right there. Here we go. This is the picture I'll try and get to. Giving us a couple more options here. Um, I this is a kit, so I don't know if it does come with any of servo ESC. Probably not, uh, because it does not say here what it includes. But again, you guys can go on the website and check that out for yourselves. Um, <clears throat> And some more news that we have. I wasn't going to go here, but here we are right now. <laughs> so Locked Up RC has come out with some new B-Lock wheels, as you guys can see right here. So they came out with some new 1.9 B-Lock wheels. Um, you can change them up whichever, which way you want. You can get different color rings for it. Um, here we go, all in the silver, or you can go red with the black and everything. Uh, this is what the wheels look like with the internal, uh, whatchamacallit, the ring, the B-lock ring right there on the side. And uh, here is the diameter of the wheel, 45.50 millimeter. Um, so they have done, there we go. That's what I was looking for. <laughs> so you can pick up these wheels for $17.50. Now, when you go to pick up these wheels, you're not just going to pick up the wheels themselves. All you're going to get with the wheels is just that. This right here is all you're getting with the beadlock ring. Uh, ring, I'm sorry. With the ring and... That's all you're going to get as it has right here where it says what's included. The 1.9 Magna SLW internal wheel with cinder finish uh, and the one internal lock ring. So the dimensions on these wheels, as we know, they are 1.9 inch V-locks, uh, 26 millimeter width, 13.5 uh, millimeter backspacing, and they weigh a total of 1.85 ounces. Um, <clears throat> now, if you want to make this wheel your own for your own rig, and of course, made in the great US of A, um, these are the stuff that you're gonna need for this wheel to be able to mount it onto your rig. Um, it will tell you here on their website, this will require uh, 
This wheel requires the 1.9 easy mount rings, which are not included. Uh, this wheel is designed to work with Vanquish products, SLW style, six lug hubs, which are not included. Uh, this wheel requires M2 by seven hardware for outer beadlock ring, which is not included. This wheel requires 440 hardware to attach an SLW hub, which is not included. And optional, you can add up to 12 additional 164 screws to this wheel for further customization. So again, you can change out whatever customization you want to do with the wheels. Um, but it's kind of nice that they, uh, they have that option here for you. So the wheels, you can pick them up for a grand total of $17.50. And the price will rack up there since you're going to have to get the hex hubs the M4s, hubs, the rear hubs, and the everything. <laughs> Basically everything that you're going to need here, it's they're going to get a little pricey for you. So don't just think that you're going to be paying $17.50 for the wheels and that's all you're going to get. You're not. You're still going to have to buy the be the rings, uh, the B locks, the the hardware. You still got to get everything. So the prices is going to go up from that $17.50. Now, uh, HPI has come out with a new body, which is the Ford F-150 SVT Raptor short course body. Uh, this thing actually looks badass. I kind of like it. <laughs> I don't have a short course truck yet, but this body looks damn good. As you guys can see, this looks really good. Let's go to the next image here. Here's the back of it. I really like it. I'm I like I do like the Raptors. I'm actually I'm a Ford guy, so I'm I like the Fords. I like the Raptors. Um, so this truck body does fit the jump shot short course version two and the jump jump shot short course flux, um, but it should fit most one tenth scale rigs that are out there. Um, all you Traxxas lovers out there, Traxxas has come out with a hobby knife. Uh, so this hobby knife, here we go. This hobby knife does have Traxxas engraved into it. Uh, it does look like it brings some more blades uh has one on there traxxas logo right there it does look like it brings some more blades uh so for all you traxxas lovers out there traxxas has done some more <laughs> they uh have come out with a hobby knife for all of us which is which is a good thing and you can get this at a grand price of $6.99 on their website. And ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, that's pretty much all I got for you today in RC News. Please hit that like button, subscribe, and I will bring out some more content for you. You guys all have a good one.